Hey viewers, welcome to my channel. Today again come up with an other video and in today's video we will learn about an important component of electrical system of your vehicle or machine and that one is a stator of a alternator. I will explain what is a stator and how to test it effectively. Stator consists of three separate windings and an iron core. It generates the alternator current when a, a router spins inside the stator and that alternating current converted into DC current to charge the batteries. So now I will let you know how we can test these stators. As you can see in front of you I put two stators. This one is a Volvo machinery stator and this was contained in the Caterpillar machineries. This stator also have three windings and this stator also have the three windings but these windings connected in the delta form and these windings are connected in a star form. Let you know how we can understand this windings, these windings in the delta form and this stator have the winding and the star connections. So first I show you I have made a drawing as you can see in front of you this I show the rectifier this one also rectifier this one is also this one is my star connections this is a stator okay this is stator this is the Y connections or star connections we called it a star or Y connections and this one is a delta connection this is also is a stator and this one has a delta connections and this is connected to the rectifier. These windings are also three windings connected to the rectifier. These also three windings in the these windings you can see the all three windings have connected to at one end and the second end goes to the rectifier. Here is these windings are connected in series. All windings connected in a series. You can see three windings connected to gathers each end connected to gathers and the other end is going there same like here you can see the each end of three windings connected together here connected to gather you can see is here okay and the other end connected to the rectifier so this these three ends goes to the rectifier so this is in our star or wide connections. This one, these wires connected to like this, this and series, these connected to together these wires because I cut from the rectifier. So these wires connected to like this. So this is a delta one wire. These two wires going to other side. These two wires goes to rectifier and these two wires also connected and goes to the rectifier like this one understand so this is our delta connection so this one is actually formed this is my rectifier and here you can see downside you can see three six here are six ends you can see one yeah, these are six ends the three wires by six end and here you can see so I cut that like that. here you windings use six windings six windings are connected here okay one one two three four and five and six so these are connected to rectifier so this is my delta connections our stator can be in in delta connections or in the star connections so now we have learned about the stator, about its constructions, 
is uh, it may be in uh, delta connections or it have the star connections it depends on the manufacturers what i will let you know how we can test this uh, stator it is uh, working or not for it i need multimeter so i put my multimeter on the buzzer side one by one check stator i show you both stators so here needs only two test first test we check the windings continuity secondly i check the continuity this windings with this uh, iron core okay so first test we check the windings our windings how much uh, ohms is uh, how much resistance we check this is one winding i check it so you can see it's giving a beep and also it's showing the 0.2 ohm it's mean my windings first coil one winding is okay similarly i check my second windings okay 0.2 okay my third winding 0.2 it mean my three windings are okay it's giving the continuity and is a oh, resistance is a 0.2 ohms so second test is that i can check my windings with the core maybe shortage it's not shorted to the body so here you can see it's a open circuit it mean my this first winding is not short to the body of this stator second winding not short to the core not short to the body third one so it mean my stator's winding is okay it not shorted to the body and it is also my winding is not uh, not broken so this mean my stator is a good one this is second stator check same we check the continuity okay but its continuity i check with it one one and this one of the these three winds i check one by one so here you can see they showing the point to ohm this wind the first winding is also okay i put my same leads here second winding my second winding as you can see is also showing point to ohm my third winding as you can also see this is giving a point to ohm and beep is coming it mean my three this winding is also okay but similarly i check my the winding there the with the body this core short so it's not showing any so it's not showing any short okay you can see it's mean my with this winding is okay this winding is this showing here you can see open loop mean it's not short is also not short so it mean my this stator is a uh, winding is also okay my stator is working good one this is these windings these coils not short to this core and also given the continuity so in this way we can test our stator if you found this video is helpful please give it a thumb up and subscribe for more auto tips drop your question in comments below bye for now let's meet in next video thank for watching